enough. You to get yeah. I'll take mine off too. Actually, I'm gonna. Ooh, mine are a little oh, bit. Oh, I feel like I'm. In, oh, I'm in a hole. How, how did that happen? <laughs> I don't know. You just sort of were in a hole at some point. No, I, I wasn't a second ago. <laughs> Um, um, yeah, no, look, my armor's all damaged. I gotta go charge that up as soon as possible. Oh, uh, but before, let's, let's take a look at my stuff, my, my magician stuff. Yeah, we haven't, we haven't filmed in a little while now, have no. we? No. And, and I actually forgot what we were up to <laughs> the last yeah. time we filmed, okay. so I had to look the film. Do but, you, by the way, think that chickens... Hey, where'd you get all these guys from? Oh. I'll I'll have to show you that. Um, but oh, before, your own farm. That's okay. yeah, before I show you that, well, the reason Little I'm baby cow. yeah, the reason I'm doing this is because I needed some resources from these guys, like wool and leather. <laughs> um, so I've been breeding the animals. But what I've noticed is my chickens aren't laying eggs. I, I think they don't like this climate. This is a fat chicken. That's a, a sheep. Oh. But look at these babies! Yeah, they're so cute. So the chickens aren't laying eggs at all? Oh, maybe it's too yeah. cold. Yeah, it has to be warm to lay eggs, I guess. Yeah, so that's really unfortunate. Um, maybe they need a little water? Oh, you think? But yeah. it'll become ice. Yeah, I but then you, if you put a torch next to it, it will be not ice anymore. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Hello, and you should give these guys a little bit of torch, too. No? Well, Not enough the place. it was honestly a, a very quick business that I did. I was... It was a product of opportunity and necessity combined. Okay, you're gonna have to explain that to me pretty soon because I have no idea what you're talking about. Well, I'll show you, I'll show you that to you in a bit, but I want to show you my bomb craft lair because I have a present for you. Yeah, I see something over here. Oh, did... Right, something... Oh, it's just a torch. Uh, hey, hey, it's here. Where? Here, my bomb craft lair oh, is yeah. beside the tower. So, I, this. I built it with, um, ex blah 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 whatever that that, that oh, stuff yeah, is. Oh yeah, blah blah. Blocks. Uh, Psychorian. Psych Psychorian. Psychorian yeah. blocks. Um, Whoa, so, yeah, what are these? Those are flames that I learned how to make. They're like ever burning flames. Um, that are one of the earlier magic things. And also, probably. What happens if like should I not touch it? What? You can you can collect it and it'll act just like a torch. So ah. look. Yeah, I mean, I was thinking they'd be pretty in our house, but you have all those cute bugs in our house, too, so I don't want to take that away. You took the torch. Here. Thank you. Um, yeah, I, I didn't want to take that away. It looks just like wisp essence, sort of. I know, that's why I thought it would be fairly appropriate for our house, but, I mean, it's also really you know nice what? for this place. It, it Actually, matches. It does match, and I think I do want some of this, because I, I have something I want to do um, in the house. Yeah. Uh, I have a little plan for this episode of something that I want to do, and these would be great for it. How much do you have of these? Uh, just the ones that are up right now, but oh. we can we can replace them with torches and after we film today... But can you, actually, can you make me some right now? Like, show us how to do that? Oh yeah, I guess so. I don't quite remember how, but um, <laughs> it, my Thaumonomicon will tell me. Okay, so you're really into this then. I've been working pretty hard at it, yeah. Um, yeah, so look, oh, I have, table. um, my most recent achievement. What are all these? Okay, I, my most recent achievement is I learned to make the Wand of the Adept, which is here in my hand, uh -huh. and look at this nice purple circle around it, Oh. but I don't really know what to do with it yet. So this thing here is a, an enchanting table or something, I forget what it's called. Okay. But anyway, it's basically the second level of magical table for crafting magical things. Beside it, the little green one is the, the first level of it. Okay. Um, and basically, you have to put a wand inside of it. Like, oh, okay, right here? Yeah, and then that kind of gives it power, and then you can make recipes as if it was a normal crafting table. Cool. Apparently, it can also do whatever a normal crafting table could do. It's so, kind of big, though. Yeah, it is really big, but it replaces two tables and it does things that other ones couldn't, so... Cool. Yeah. Very nice. And then there's my scribey table, and then... Yeah. Da, 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 where's my present? Oh, there's something in here, in your scribey table. 
Research notes. Unknown theory. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah, because I'm in the middle of researching something. Spriggable spliggoblop. Bishpiggy spiggabloop. Oh, yeah. I, I put a separate box for all the stuff I needed to show you. Okay. Okay. So, Ooh. number one, I have this thing which is supposed to point... Wait, hold on. I gotta... Okay. What is that? Um, it's... I forget what it's called. A thermometer, and it's thermometer. 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 Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's supposed to tell you where sources of like thom weird mystical energies are, but I mean I followed it. Ooh, a candle! Can I hit it? Yeah, you could hit it. You could keep that. I think the candles are pretty ugly. That was one of the magical things that I was able to make. Cool. So I, I tried following this around to find nodes because I'm pretty sure I have accidentally made a bad node in my area here. Ooh, I um, saw something. A wisp? No. What? A rail line. Oh yeah. Okay, but let me finish telling you. Okay, all right, sorry. Go is ahead. that it points in directions of of nodes? I think. Oh. So I tr oh. I tried to follow it. But did it, did it, it lead back to our house? No, it just led to like a random spot, and I was like, well, you know what, I, I don't even know what to do about this. Okay, actually, that's a good point, because I know one thing about Thomcraft, besides like what I told you to start yeah. you off on, uh, and that's there are something called... Actually, I know some of the items you can make. One uh -huh. of them is goggles of revealing. Mm-hmm. Right, and uh, apparently these goggles revealing, when you put them on, it tells you how much like aura and flux is in the atmosphere. Yeah. And it also reveals nodes. Yeah, but then once you know where a node is, because this thing points you to, no nodes. to nodes, so you can yeah. identify where the node is. But, but then, you don't know what kind of node it is. Well, yeah, but like for instance, if we did this near our house, mm -hmm. maybe we should, and then we'd know where the node is, but then what do we do about that? Um, yeah. Well, okay, actually, that's a good point, because I was looking into trying to how to find a way to eliminate nodes, and it turns out everything I've been doing so far was uh, probably only making the node bigger. Oh. Uh, <laughs> um, even the silver trees? Uh, even silver trees, because uh, a powerful evil node will gobble up any other node that's nearby it, and oh, then just make no. it bigger. Exactly. So what you have to do, apparently, is make another pure node far away from it, like 50 or more blocks away from it. Oh, and it'll pull things. And in. then, no, and then make it bigger and bigger and bigger. And once the pure node is big enough, bigger than the other node, then then you could, like, find a way to get them close together so that the pure node eats up the evil node. Interesting. Yeah. Sounds but the problem different. is, I need I need to know where and what and how big they are. Okay, well, this would tell us where it is. Okay, but that that's a project for another day. Yeah, uh, but anyway, I want to because we have a we have a patch. We have a uh... yeah, that's <laughs> we, really exciting. We, people, I I can't wait to show people yeah, that. Yeah, we have a band aid for our wisp problem in our house right now, and it, it's working pretty well actually. Yeah. Okay, um, so what was the other thing? Okay, so the other thing is, oh no, this is the most exciting thing. Well, I don't know, actually. Okay, number nine. Nine, I have... Number nine? Sorry, it's number nine on my keyboard. Oh. <laughs> I, have, I have new pants! <laughs> oh, They're... I thought you just took off your pants for a second there. No. They look so... See on the side, it's but like... wait. They're like short shorts. They're like magician's pants. Magician short shorts. Yeah. <laughs> it's, and and, um... and some of it looks almost like your skin color, so yeah. it looks like it's... I know. Never... I know. Yeah. It's you got never bad. nude pants on. It's like... It's like wow, lady armor. Yeah. You know? But anyway, I wonder what the rest of it looks like. I don't know. Well, the thing is that I ran out of spider silk and all the things that uh -huh. I need to make this. You're using my spider silk. I I use it all. Oh boy. And I've been trying to grow flax, but it won't grow in this cold climate. Um, so I have the pants, and hopefully I'll have the rest of the outfit. Okay, well I might be able to help you out with that, because, uh, my bees... Oh, they can make string? They can make, uh, silk, silk strands or something like that. Wisp silk, 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 silky, silky, silk, silkity silk. Okay. Which then turns into, uh, string. you put them together to make string. Okay. And, uh, but it, I can't make much of it right now, but mm -hmm. maybe eventually it'll be mass production, who knows? Yeah. 
But yeah, maybe flax is a better idea for that. Maybe. Um, okay, so then the other thing is... I, I have two little presents for you, okay. but we should go outside. Okay. So, maybe a little far from my house, maybe okay. with ground under us. Okay. How about right here? Uh, huh? Yeah, here. Okay. Um, be a little careful. Okay. This what? is for you. What is this? Um, it's a... Alumentum. Can produce 16KU. Oh, like, kind of like a cold coke. It's... Can, can cold coke explode? No, it's just, it's just a fuel. What do you no, mean it's if explode? No, if you throw it, it's going to make a big explosion. Whoa! Yeah, exactly. Super fun. That is awesome. I know, but it takes, you know, not insignificant work to make anything in Bombcraft, right? It's okay. Always... So, like, it's hard. you can't, like, mass produce it, you don't think? Well, I don't know how to mass produce Bombcraft. Well, I don't know how to mass produce any items. Okay. Um, okay, and the last thing I want to give you... That's awesome, though. I want some more of that. If you can make me more of that, I'd be very happy. Yeah. Is this scoop? Ooh, scoopity scoop. It's a magical scoop, and ah. it's supposed to be stronger than normal scoops, and it can be repaired and enchanted and stuff. Enchanted? Yes, that is yeah, great. I Thank can, you. I'll read I like you, enchanted. I'll read you the the thing about it. Okay. Thaumium scoop. This improved scoop is more durable than the plain one your non-magical beekeeping friends are liable to use. It is good for three times as long as the average scoop at the cost of using some Fontium instead. Because the Fontium present in its construction, it is possible to enchant the scoop with a repairing spell in the usual manner. Okay. So yeah, and right now my research is moving towards trees and bees. So hopefully I'll be able to discover some stuff, <laughs> some, <laughs> some stuff that's useful for you, and I'll give you more presents in the future. Thank you, Leels. You're welcome. Okay, uh, so other... yeah, so one of the gifts I gave you, by the way, which I think is is spurring yeah. all this generosity, is something you have on right now. Yeah, this awesome jetpack that I've been flying around in so much. And it's charging your, uh, it's charging your drill there. Oh, so. My drill is just permacharged because I'm wearing Because this. you're wearing the jetpack, yeah. Well, the jetpack uses it uses the jetpack's charge. Yeah. Uh, but it's so little, so it doesn't really matter. Mm -hmm. and, okay. Oh, yeah, go ahead, sorry. Just the last thing about thaumic whatever. My One of my recent discoveries is a unified thaumatic field theory. Okay. Which is really cute because it's like they're paralleling physics, you know. Uh. Unified theory... Field theory, blah yeah. blah. So cute. I really appreciate those little touches. Yeah, me too. That's cool. Uh huh. So these pants, supposedly I should be able to enchant them and make them better than normal leggings, but I don't know how to yeah, do that I stuff yet. Do that. Oh, well, oh, actually, I could tell you all about it. I could tell you like... all about it. That's where I'm coming. That's where I come in. Okay, tell me. Okay. First of all, number one. Look, the little sheep is listening to. Hey, sheepy. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So number one, my mining drill is enchanted. Yeah. I found a book in a chest somewhere that had efficiency five. Ooh. And uh, and because of this, look what it could do. Ready? Okay. Oh, did it just like collect five blocks at once? It just like you just hold down the button and it goes. Wow, that is dangerous. Dangerous, and it gets. Uh, this really fast too, ridiculously fast. Anyway, you yeah. like I want to make I want to make you a very similar mining drill, but I I have to find an efficiency book. I have not been able to make one yet. Oh okay. It's been I, I've been trying and trying and trying, oh. but it's really hard. Uh, in fact, I have like a hundred no not a hundred, but I have a lot of enchanted books that are everything <laughs> but in efficiency five. Oh. Or efficiency for any efficiency. I don't think I got any efficiencies yet. It's really bad. Maybe that's hard to get for some reason. Yeah. Okay. So okay. So for, now tell me about these cows and why they're here. Okay. Well. Did you need to get? Do you have a mining cart with you right now? I do not. Do you have any iron? Uh, I do inside. Okay. So do do do. <laughs> Let me just go. Whoa, look at all this cobblestone. 
Where'd that come from? Oh, yeah, you dig a tunnel. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, here's some iron. One, two, three, four, five. Hey, what's this? Music disc. Uh, what's... You got a music disc in one of your box. Let's try oh, it out yeah. in the music player. I was flying around, and I saw a, ba a chest on the top of a hill, so I took the stuff out. Good idea. A whisk attacked me. Okay. So I got five, your irons over here, by the way, in this box. Which box? Yeah. Um, right. I was also looking for some gravel while we were at it. Okay, why gravel? Um... Because I want... Oh, I already had iron, actually. Okay. That was silly. So I have a minecart now. You do. Okay. Where do I go with it? What's this? No, it's not down here. Oh. Okay, oh. you want to head home? Uh, yes. Okay, so... Ooh, -hoo, metro. Homeward bound. Wait, Wait, is there another bound somewhere? Yeah. Well, over here... It's village bound. Oh yeah, the village. And it takes you to the village. We gotta work on that village sometime soon. I know, I'm not sure what we should do for them, you know? I don't know what they want. I don't know what they need. How am I supposed to understand? I don't live there. <laughs> okay, we'll figure something out. Uh-huh. But like, we'll just take a look and we'll be like, oh, you know what this place could need? Yeah. A water park. Or, hey, you know what this place could need? Uh, a bridge right over here. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, so... Okay, so tell me how... Well, I know how you... Is it just like a normal, uh... Pretty much, except it just has stops and starts, so you press the button to go. <laughs> you are so cute. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, my little legs sticking out. Okay. Oh gonna, god. It's I'm so gonna, cute. <laughs> I'm gonna head out. Okay. <laughs> and then you follow me in your minecart, right? Um, yes. Okay, well, uh... Here she goes, <laughs> off on an adventure. <laughs>